I'm Bo Jackson. I'm your host. Welcome back to the show. Hyunjung, you want to say hi to everybody? Okay. Hello, colorful Bo. Hello, Hyunjung. And hello, everybody. It's great to see you again. And let's learn some more Korean today. Hi, hello, everyone. Hello, everyone. <laughs> we're happy to see you again. Okay, today, this episode, <laughs> we're going to learn how to form past tense verbs. So let's get cracking. Hey. Hey. What's up? How you doing? Good. What you do this weekend? Oh, I met my boyfriend. Date has Oh, really? What did you Tomorrow, I have a promotion examination. Gongbulul has Oh, really? Good luck to you. Yeah, I hope so. Okay, as you can see from my little skit, today we're going to learn how to form the past tense with our verbs. Okay? It's asoyo uh, or osoyo. We're going to add those to the verb stem. Okay? It's similar to ayo or oyo. Take the verb stem and add asoyo or osoyo. For example, kada. Kada. How do we make the past tense with kada? Kada. Because it has ka, we'll put kasoyo. Kasoyo. Okay? But there's a simple rule to follow, right? If the verb stem ends with a or o, we put kasoyo next to the verb stem, okay? So this time you have to be very careful not to say kasoyo, kasoyo, okay? Just do it clean. Kasoyo, kasoyo, okay? Hyunjun Shi, let's have that pronunciation. Okay, kada. The verb stem is ka. So you want to add asoyo and make it together. Kasoyo, kasoyo. Okay, so those little s shia things go under the ka? Yes. So, oh, okay, right. So, ready? Yeah. Kasoyo. Kasoyo. I went. Yeah, perfect. Robert. Yeah. Did you meet your girlfriend yesterday? Now, if you use this verb, you're going to you're going to use manada. Manada, which means to meet, okay? So, Robert, did you meet your girlfriend yesterday? Say it in Korean. Okay, so mana Soyo, manasoyo, Excellent. because manada, and then put put it under manasoyo. Perfect. Manasoyo, manasoyo. Jamie, I heard you went shopping. Did you go shopping? Uh, I go shopping yeah, every day. Yeah, she bought this shirt for me. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah. Wow. Thank you very much. Really, really, thank so, you. So, sasoyo, sasoyo. Could I use that to to say I bought something? So, Jamie, you bought some clothes, right? right. In that case, you want to say 옷을 샀어요. And then there are other verbs. These are verbs that have hada, hada at the end of them, okay? Those verbs that take hada, you make the past tense and change them to hesoyo, hesoyo. Say, for example, to study. So, study will be kumbu, kumbu hesoyo, kumbu hesoyo, okay? So, let's work with this past tense, okay? Robert, do you like swimming? Did you swim this morning? <laughs> I think he did. <laughs> wow. 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 I love swimming. I love so how do you say swimming in Korean? Suyong. Suyong. And what's the question? Did I go swimming? Yes. Yes. I swam. I swam. So in Korean I say Suyong Hesoyo. Anything, anything that you did, Momomo Hesoyo. Momomo Hesoyo. So in this case, swimming, I swam. Suyong. Hesoyo. Wow. Jamie, do you like yes, swimming? So. Do you like swimming now or did you like swimming before? Mm, no, but I used to like uh, to do ballet. Oh, ballet. Yeah, <laughs> but I don't like it anymore. So, can I say Joa Hesoyo? Wow, like, great. Joa Hesoyo. <laughs> Let's Joa do some. Hesoyo. <laughs> Excellent. Okay, up until now we've taken verbs that end in a or o or take hada. Okay? In the other cases where they don't end in a, o, and take hada, we, we use osoyo to make the past tense. Osoyo, okay? So, Robert, where is my apple? I saw an apple, uh, wait a second, wait a second. Oh, I'm really sorry, I'm really, really hungry. This is your apple? Yeah, it was my apple. I'm sorry, Why I did you ate eat it? it? You ate both food again? I, I ate it, it's I'm sorry. Eat. So in in Korean, uh, um, apple is sagwa, sagwa ru, mogosoyo. Wow, you said it really correctly. So you are off the hook now. Mogosoyo, mogosoyo. Okay, number one, Robert, you have to pay me back. Number two, don't talk with your mouth full. 
all right so that was mine all right so robert did we learn how to say hi to people or i think hi yeah on young i say all right so we learned that well how do you say learn and learned how do you say learn in korean you learned that didn't you okay let's check out that pronunciation yeah okay the basic form would be and you would like to say the past tense 배웠어요. 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 how about jamie you read don't you how about did you ever read the da vinci code that book yes actually i did uh so i would say wow great excellent let's try again 읽었어요. All right, let's practice these together. Why don't we talk about what you did yesterday? Okay, 현정 씨, 어제 뭘 했어요? Oh, you know that we did it together. Yes. <laughs> 영화를 <laughs> 봤어요. <laughs> 영화를 봤어요. And I paid for it. <laughs> okay. Okay, I'd like to ask to Jamie. <laughs> 어제 뭘 했어요, Jamie? Uh, oh yeah, we met each other and she bought me this shirt. Also, <laughs> 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 right? Wow, yeah. Thanks. All right, you know what time it is? What about Oje bol hesayo and there is multiple choice there is two answer number 1 학교에 가요 number 2 학교에 갔어요 so which one is the right answer for the question okay is it number 1 가요 is it number 2 갔어요 let's think about it okay and we'll be back with the answer in just a sec <laughs> Oh, my brain hurts. Number one or number two? Kyle or Kasayo? Hyunjung, help us out. What's All right. the answer? I got the answer for you. Number two, Kasayo, past tense. 학교에 갔어요. Number two, Kasayo. Okay, tune in to our next episode where we're going to learn some simple words to learn when you're going to go shopping. And if you're lucky, you're going to find Miss Seoul in the store. Okay, so wait. stay tuned for that. <laughs> <laughs> so tell us where you can find us online, Robert. www.ebs.co.kr and click in the search window. Hello, Anyong Haseo. Put a search on there, it'll take you to our page. Now, it's very good to start reviewing because these complex verb changes, past tense things, very important. So check it out online. Very important, ebs.co.kr. Click it into your web browser and catch us online, all right? And there's a really good picture of me online, if you want to show <laughs> that. And, we should change and the a great, picture great with your new hair. Okay, yeah. until then, study hard, take care, and we'll see you next time. 안녕히 계세요. 안녕히 계세요. Bye-bye. Take care.